541 in progress. Five twenty one in progress. Five fifty three in progress. One complete. Five thirty in progress. Fifty three complete. Thirty complete. Five fifty four in progress. Five fifty four complete. Five fifty four in progress.
554 complete. Five thirteen in progress. These people die for beer. The roots grow. And the hen ran around. Five fifteen in progress. She said, if you want my fricassee, you'll have to run me down. Five thirteen complete. Five fifty one in progress. Five thirty one in progress. I followed you right from town to town. Five fifteen complete. Don't you leave. Five fifty one complete. Five fifty four in progress. Five thirty one complete. Five fifty four complete. Five fifty two in progress.
552 complete. By the way, this won't be the first attack on the Sharpwood Sheriff's Department. Moreno brought me a pile of old newspapers here. Yeah, the, the poor bastard collects newspapers, can you figure? Not comics, no, nothing easy like that. No, newspapers, old ones, new ones, local, overseas, all sorts. I bet he's got a whole closet filled with newspapers with your name on the front page. Well, he brought me some to read from his collection, and it turns out that back in 52, the department got a bunch of Molotov cocktails through the front window. They barely saved the building. Then in 59, there was a gunfight, and then in 1960, there was another one. So look at it this way, Jack. We're going with tried and true methods. But it's the first attack on the sheriff's department where the sheriff's gonna get killed. <laughs> Let's hope at the last one. <laughs> now look at it this way. Excuse me, Colonel, but Mr. Summers wants to talk to you. He said that if you don't explain right now why Friday's delivery was delayed... Rocky, what the fuck? Don't you see that we're talking here? Did it cross your mind that this could be more important? Do you think that First Deputy Nash and me are sitting here playing pool? Colonel, I, I Rocky, just... Rocky, if we were still serving the army, I'd bust you down a latrine duty. You'd be clearing toilets in the barracks with a toothbrush for a month. But you know what? I might just make you do that anyhow. I can do that, right? How do you like that idea, Rocky? You probably already forgot I'll what I'll wait it's... for you outside, Colonel. As for the details, there aren't many people in this town I can trust, so try not to get my guys killed. Yours are a dime a dozen, and mine are itching for a good gunfight. So two or three cops are going to get shot. Maybe five at most. Just pick the ones you don't mind getting rid of. I don't think you'll have much of a problem with that. And there's something else. What? Maybe we should shoot you, too. Oh, yeah, that'd be great. <laughs> no, 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 I just mean a little poke. Slightly shot. In the hand and leg for heroism. So nobody has any doubt that it was First Deputy Nash who bravely defended the department, standing firm while the bullets flew past. Who else could be the next sheriff? I'm the First Deputy. If Sheriff Reed dies, I'll automatically take her place. Why make any extra fuss? Come on, Jack. You never watch a movie? All the heroes are wounded at the end. They all have scars. They're, they're getting interviewed by the press from their hospital beds, promising to return to service as soon as possible and set things straight. Otherwise, it's just too boring. And if the injury turns out to be serious enough that I can't physically manage the duties of sheriff, how boring would that be? You know what? You're right. Better not to take any chances. You need anything from me? I have ten boxes of fireworks. We could fill the whole place with smoke and really make it look like something. Arthur Sherman. Huh? Arthur Sherman. He knows who I am. It'd be better if I discussed it with him. Personally. Bring him to me. Okay, Jack. Okay. If that's what you want. But listen. That harmless college boy couldn't even... Colonel, I'm sorry. I tried to tell For him that... For fuck's it... sake! Mr. Nash, you remember me saying something about not killing my guys? Let's, let's make an exception. Shoot this bastard! Remember the red mustache? Put it in the mud! Mr. Summers said that if you don't speak to him right away, he's gonna turn you into the sheriff. You hear that, Sheriff Nash? That's a serious threat. Serious! I better go and talk to him, right? <laughs> Just stick to the plan, Jack. Soon everything will be set.
544 in progress. Five forty seven in progress. Five twenty four in progress. Five forty four complete. Can you nearly destroy this light of mine? Oh, love, 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 endless love. In your five forty seven complete. Five fifty one in progress. When I wore my apron high. When I wore my apron high. No, you never do pass by. Five twenty four complete. Five fifty one complete. Five forty four in progress. Five twenty nine in progress. Five forty seven in progress. You know we killed your happy and your grand happy too. And if you don't look out, it's gonna be the death of you. Five ten in progress. Five forty seven complete. Five ten complete.
Arthur Sherman. <laughs> no need to sign for him. 